glad to be going to Arunachal. I have the official certificate now. So Arunachal, here we come. Hi, my name is Rajiv Kohli and I represent Creative Travel. Creative is a destination management company headquartered in Delhi, operating all over India, Nepal, Bhutan, Sri Lanka and uh, Tibet. Been around for 43 years. Hi, this is Sanjay Imam. I've come all the way from Bangalore. I run a company called Panash, which specializes in customized travel all over the world. We are uh, crossing the Sela Pass now, which is at 13,700. Uh, moment of joy. Hi, my name is Rajan Tiwari, and I work as a travel professional. I'm a travel advisor. I'm here in this beautiful place called Taban. My name is Vishwas Makija. I run a company called India Inside Tours uh, and India Adventure. I've been in the business 25 years of adventure travel, um, selling dreams, selling holidays, selling uh, passion to people from all over the world. My name is Ritu. I run a travel company called Is India Travel. Um, I'm from Pune, Maharashtra. I was uh, very honored to be invited on this trip by Okin. I'm Rajesh Oja. I run an adventure travel company, Banjara Camps and Retreats Private Limited. I run a tour operating company based out of Delhi. And uh, I'm very happy to be part of Siangres 2020. I thank Okin and our world country and the government of Arunachal to ask us to come and so far such wonderful, beautiful welcome and we are enjoying our stay. My name is Ajit Bajaj. I'm an adventurer, explorer and an entrepreneur in adventure tourism. I run a company called Snow Leopard Adventures. So I think Arunachal is like one of the last uh, frontiers of tourism. It's so remote, so beautiful and very few people have seen it. So I think that is something that uh, travelers crave. Uh, they want to go to places that other people haven't been to before and which have not been uh, spoiled by over tourism. So in that sense, Arunachal is very, very special. My name is Amit Dikshit. I'm the editor of Outlook Traveler magazine. And this is my first time in this part of the world. And I'm loving every minute of it. Well, first of all, Siang Rash is not a tourism festival. Uh, this is a very special event uh, curated to promote sustainable, responsible and eco-friendly tourism in Arunachal Pradesh. Uh, each uh, year, each uh, edition, we have a targeted and a very specialized uh, focus for an outcome of the event. In our first edition, you know, we are intending to get ourselves broadcasted and published in uh, good journals, good magazines and through good bloggers. So we had invited uh, you know, a good number of people, uh, writers, travel writers, travel bloggers and uh, you know, give them an experience, showcase our state, our beauty, of our nature and our tribes so that they can go back and uh, you know, uh, narrate the story, write what they have experienced and share it with the world. We were published in magazines like Condenas Traveler, Outlook Traveler, Lonely Planet and all this. So this year we have invited uh, about eight of top high-end luxury tour operators of India and uh, with what they have experienced, what they have seen, they will give us their opinion, their advice, their feedback and a roadmap finally to how to initiate top high-end uh, tourism in Arunachal Pradesh because we want to stay away from, as much as we can, we want to stay away from the mass, uh, low value tourism, and you know, place Arunachal, create Arunachal as a very, very special destination, very niche kind of uh, operation where there is a low impact and high value kind of activity.
or something, bro. On behalf of our Chief Minister, I would personally like to thank the captains of uh, tourism. All of you are here on our Chief Minister's invitation and we are very grateful. And the keenness with which you have uh, visited the places and give very positive feedback on how we can take the tourism forward. We'll have a proper workshop based upon your feedback, you know, again discussion. And I will invite my local tool operators also based on your feedback, you know, what are your views upon tourism. So hopefully I think uh, Arunachal will, will slowly lead the way towards you know, good tourism. Hi, Rajan Tiwari back again here. I'm here in this beautiful town city called Tawang and what a beautiful experience we had here. And so the Tawang Monastery itself is very historical. So somehow for me, for a history buff, uh, it's paradise because you have everything. You have culture, you have history, you have you know intrigue. Uh, there's a lot of mystery and you also have these lovely, lovely people. We have been here last two days. Uh, it's really a jewel, hidden jewel I think which Arunachal has. Uh, from our adventure travel point of view or from tourism point of view that lot many beautiful hotels have come. And we were living in a, a very good hotels and lot many other projects are coming. And which I see that now we will be able to bring some good quality travellers to uh, Tawang and uh, that is what also gives me joy that we will be connecting with Tawang more often. This destination is definitely beautiful. What I did tell my friends on my social media yesterday that this destination has the potential to give Bhutan a serious run for its money in. Tawang will be a central point for that. It was a wonderful stay. Um, very short unfortunately. I would like to come back and see a lot more and spend a lot more time learning about the history, especially in the monastery, to see the pictures of His Holiness arriving in India, to see all the dignitaries who came here, to see that history. Um, I would hope to find somebody who was around at that time who would share more stories. But you know, it's only been day four and we have six more to go and I'm just, every day is a new story and we're excited. Just look around me. You have the mountains and they are so beautiful, forested and pristine. It's amazing to be here. The times that we have spent with the Lamas uh, at the nunnery, it has been, they've all been so warm. You know, that is the point that got touched. It's beautiful. I love Arunachal and I'd love to send people here. It's been such a revelation to find a place like this in our country. And of course, meeting the Honorable Chief Minister of Arunachal was the icing on the cake. It's a very beautiful waterfall. And most of all, I love the river. So, this is the Tawang River. And it becomes Manas when it enters Assam. Lovely. Yeah, 
सियांग राज इस साल का बहुत खास है क्योंकि सियांग राज का दौरा हमारे टूरिज्म सेक्टर में जो एक्टिविटी जो है बाहर से आने डोमेस्टिक टूरिज्म को अभी ट्वेंटी अक्टूबर से ओपन किया गया है और आज यहाँ सियांग रस ग्रुप के साथ हमारा जो विजिटर्स है और गेस्ट के साथ हमारा इंट्रेक्शन मीटिंग हुआ था और आने वाला समय में सियांग राज द्वारा हमारा टूरिज्म का पोटेंशियल जो हो और बढ़ेगा और अगले साल का जितना भी टूरिज्म एक्टिविटी इस तरह से आगे बढ़ाने के, के लिए हमारे सरकार का वचनबद्ध है सियांग राज ट्री जो है अरुणाचल प्रदेश को नीच टूरिज्म डेस्टिनेशन बनाने के लिए एक प्लेटफॉर्म है और एक प्रोग्राम रखा है जो टूरिज्म डिपार्टमेंट के कोलाबोरेशन के साथ में Whoever is going in this paddle raft and the man is going there I think has to ensure that Mr Kohli gets a good dip in the sea and today then he he will be free spirited even more no, no cuts no glory Rapid was fascinating. Very good rapid, going almost 15 feet high, and great, great, a great Siang rush, thrilling, adventurous, having fun, Siang rush, rock.